Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you this inspired look by Selena Gomez the day that she went to the 2015 American Music Awards. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy this look. So without further ado, let's begin. The first thing that I did was apply loose powder underneath my eye to make sure uh, if there is any fallouts from the eyeshadow, it grabs it and at the end, I just sweep it away. So as you guys can see, I'm just doing like um, putting the loose powder right on the side. That way it gives me a guide to where the eyeshadow is going to go. Then I am going to apply this color from the It Cosmetics palette. It's called Sunset and I'm applying it with the 224 brush and I'm just applying it right on the crease doing windshield wiper motion going back and forth from the outer corner of the eye to the inner corner doing circular motions as well just to make sure everything is well blended and there is no harsh lines. Next what I'm going to do is apply this Red Earth color from Modus Cosmetics with my E45 brush by Sigma and this is like a tamper like um very precision brush so it's gonna help me just accentuate this color color on the outer V of my eye and then I'm just dabbing that color in to just make sure the pigment really grabs on really grab on the eye and then I'm just pulling it up to the crease and I'm just right on the socket of the eye I'm just gonna concentrate that color just to make sure there's more pigmentation there and it's more vibrant. And the loose powder just help helping me just make sure the eyeshadow doesn't go too lower or just, I don't know, it just helps me. It just guides, um, it just guides to where to place the eyeshadow. Uh, and it's a great tip for you to apply. And then I'm just going back and forth. So as you guys can see, I'm going back and forth from the 224 brush to the E45. Just because I want to make sure it blends very nicely. So as you guys can see, this brush is more fluffy. So this is the brushes that actually help you to blend. Now the smaller brushes are going to help you to concentrate the color in the area that you want it to be. So next now I'm going to grab the 239 brush by MAC. It's a flat brush so you can use any flat brush that you owe. You don't necessarily have to use this one. This is just the one that I use. I use many, many flat brushes so I don't have a preference for a flat brush. Any flat brush works. So the color that I'm using now is from Modus Cosmetics and it's called Pink Diamond. And I use a little bit of the Mineralized Skin Finish by MAC. And uh, or you can use the Fix Plus or any finisher spray will do the same thing. So this is just going to make sure that the color looks more vibrant and it gives it more vibrancy and it just helps it stick to the eye even better, especially when you're working with glittery eyeshadows. So now I'm just grabbing, going back to the E45 brush with a little bit of color and just blending those two colors together so there's no harsh lines. And you can see where the colors meet. So I'm going back and forth, back and forth, you guys are uh, watching now. And then I am going to grab just a flat brush and I'm just going to apply the same red earth um, shadow right on my lower lash line. And I'm just going to do go back and forth on the eye from the inner corner to the outer corner and accentuate that color there. Next, I am going to grab the Eye Pencil Feline by MAC and I'm just going to line my waterline, my lower waterline and my upper waterline. And then I'm going to grab these um, really pointy brush by Crown Brush. I will list down the uh, below the brushes that I use. Um, this is just a regular, very precision brush and I'm just going to grab the eyeshadow Vino from Modus Cosmetics and I'm just going to... Um, line my lines kind of like create like a soft liner to just when I apply the lashes it just blends very nicely so I'm gonna start with the Vino because it's a lighter shade and then I'm gonna go to the Onyx to the Onyx eyeshadow from Modus as well with an angle brush and I'm just gonna put that right on top and actually I'm gonna do it in the inner corner as well just to make sure everything goes together and when I apply the lashes it just just blends and you can't see where the um where the lashes are and for the angle brush you can just use any angle brush that you have or any flat brush very tiny flat brush that you can concentrate the color right right on the um, lashes then I am going to curl my lashes and then I am going to apply 
mascara just to make sure that the lashes blends with the falsies. And then I am going to use the Huda Beauty Main Collection in the style uh, Bridget. And I absolutely love these lashes. Um, it just gives you the perfect winged effect to your eye. Um, it goes from lower to a little bit longer at the end. So that's what's going to give you that almond look. There we go. And then I am going to apply tons of mascara on my bottom lashes. And I'm here using the tele telescopic mascara from L'Oreal, which I absolutely love. And then it's time to get rid of all that loose powder from underneath my eye. And voila. So next, I am putting the High Beam Highlighter by Benefit Cosmetics, which is one of my favorite highlighters of all time. It's probably one of my, the one of my favorite highlighters for the winter, for the winter time, and for this month. Um, so yeah, so I just want to apply it right on my cheekbone, and I'm blending it out with the Beauty Blender, and then I put a little bit on my nose, like right on the bridge of my nose. And I already did the other side. I was just showing you where to where I do. I placed the highlighter and because I already have the lips on which by the way the lips I use just a lip liner from MAC in the shade world so just on a side note in case you were wondering and then voila this is the finished look I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial um I try to do this slick look on my on my hair but it didn't quite go as I wanted it to go so I tried my best and I hope you guys really like this look see you guys next time bye